Welcome back to Outdoor Guys. I'm Brian if you're new to the channel. Today I got yet another tackle warehouse unboxing for you. I got 15% off on their Memorial Day sale. Go ahead and drop a comment down below. Let me know if you got the same. Also, let me know what you guys got. I got some really cool stuff I'm excited to show you guys. But before we go ahead and get into this unboxing, I want you guys to check out my Lock Raven Big Bass Spawn Series. I'll put a card right up here so you guys can click right on that. I got into some really nice bass guys, caught some big ones, so I definitely want you guys to see that. Big fish, big fish guys, big fish. Five, six pounder, five, six pounder. First cast on a five inch black and blue Senko. She was on the bed. We're here at Lock Raven Reservoir. That's what I'm talking about right there. Big bass, yeah. It's one of that thing's teeth, yuck. Look at that, get that out of here. Pickerel tooth. Stay on, stay on, stay on, stay on. Don't go under the boat, don't go under the boat. Enjoy. Yep. There she goes. We're going geese hunting. Remind me, make sure we go goose hunting this year. There you go. That's nice. That's nice. I'm a dark sleeper. Another one on a black and blue sink out. I got a little treat for you at the end too. I actually got a surprise unboxing, uh, some baits that I wanted to show you. So make sure you stay tuned and hang around to the end of the video so you make sure you see that. Most importantly, you know I'm not gonna let you forget this. Make sure you smash that subscribe button down for me. If you guys like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Hit that like button. I also appreciate it if you would go ahead and share these videos too. All right guys, it's time to go ahead and See what we got in here. I'm not going to tell you like I usually do. You're going to have to wait and see. <laughs> That'll be the thumbnail. Oops. Lost some stuff. Here's my order, 224.38. What to start with? Let's see. I try to start with the fun stuff for you guys so you watch this whole thing. I don't want to lose anybody yet. How many did I get of these? I think I got four of these. Three, four. All right. I don't think I can hold four up at once. Maybe I can, I don't know. I got the S Waver 168s. The bottom one is powder, and then the top one is the Terminator color. All right. And I also got these two, and the top one right here is Light Trout, and the bottom one, Abalone? Abalone Shad. If I'm Butchering that, I don't know. That's what it looks like. I have the uh, the 200 size and the S waiver. I've only thrown that once. Um, I believe it's around three ounces. It was pretty heavy, so I wanted to drop down. I don't like throwing heavy baits. I don't know what it is about that, but so I figured I'd drop down to the 168. I think these are one and five eighths ounce. So these are definitely you know lighter than the three ounce or the lighter than the 200. So so there they are again. S Waver 168. It's the four colors I got. I didn't have any in that size. I'll take one out for you guys so you can see it. It's a, uh, it's definitely a glide bait. As far as swim baits go, they're on the cheaper end. You can definitely get into some expensive stuff. These were 16 bucks a piece. I think they're regular 18 with that 15% off that I got for the Memorial Day sale. Jeez, these things are packaged good. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's the shag colored one. It's got that green back to it. Kind of like a gizzard shad. It's got a chartreuse underneath the head. And it's it's kind of translucent and it's got that like hologram shine to it. 
Looks like a real fish. It looks good. I like it. Real stout. Hooks on it. Sharp. Just went into my nail. But that should definitely get us bit. I can't wait to throw that at um, Lock Raven Reservoir. Alright, what to go to next? Stay tuned, don't be clicking off this video. I got some more cool stuff to show you. Don't go anywhere. I'll go ahead and jump right into these. I got this new color by um, Strike King. It's called Wicked. I got the 2.5 um, KVD crankbait over here. Really cool color. I'm trying to get that to focus for you. And then I got the Red Eye Shad as well in the same color. This is the half ounce. These do, just so you know, they do have a chartreuse belly on them, both of them. Alright, had to restock on my Senkos 5 inch black and blue laminates. You'll know why when you see my. Definitely check out that Lock Raven Big Bass Spawn Series. I'll link it up here again, I'll put a card up there. It's the same one I was talking about at the beginning of the video. Definitely was getting hooked up on these guys. Can't go wrong with a Senko. One of my favorites by far. Alright, let's keep it moving. I guess I'll go ahead and finish the soft plastics while we're there. I got the uh, Strike King Rage Tail Crawl Chunks. And I got Summer Crawl. I got Falcon Lake Crawl. I got Black and Blue. I got Green Pumpkin. And I got Blue Crawl. And they're excellent for putting on the uh, back of your jigs or using as a jig trailer. Alright, moving on to the Savage Gear Bluegills. And now uh, these are three inch bluegill swim baits. I got them in this is let's see. This is light gill. I see that. Okay, I also got the same bluegill and dark gill. Okay, and I also got it in Black Crappy. And these are cool little swim baits, guys. I bought these for bed fishing. It's got that top hook exposed. You can see that there. Let me open one up for you. And it also has a, like a split ring at the bottom where you can attach a treble hook to. I'll show you guys one of these. A lot of the times on beds, I like having a smaller profile, depending. I mean, if you pay attention, you'll see what size fish are trying to get to the, the bass fry. But um, I've always had bigger stuff, and I want more smaller profile baits. As you can see, there's, the, um, there's that top hook that's exposed. And then down here right at the bottom, see that? You can put a treble hook as well depending on if you know what you're fishing around so i'm gonna try just with this top hook and see how i do with them i might put troubles depending all right let's go right into the storm wild eye live sunfish same type of deal but that's their sunfish color guys um these actually have troubles already attached on them so you don't have to worry about doing that yourself and they have the top hook i also got it in the bluegill color they're one fourth of an ounce, quarter ounce. Again, this is the bluegill color. Okay? They're actually a little bit smaller than a Savage Gear one. And then I stepped up to the bigger guys. Same thing, Wild Eye Live Bluegill. Um, this is bluegill color over here. This is a Sunfish. And these are 5 16 of an ounce. They're three inches. The other ones were the twos, the smaller ones. So. Again, over here you got your sunfish color, and then you got your bluegill over here. These are bigger, they're not huge, but they're definitely, I mean, from two to three, it's definitely a big difference. Alright? I only got one of these. Everywhere is sold out of these Mega Bass Dark Sleepers. It's the three inch, three eighths ounce. And this color, what's this called? Clear pink. I'm a huge fan of these guys. If you see my other videos, you'll see why. But um, great little paddle tail swim baits. It's very versatile. I love fishing them on beds. Um, you can pretty much catch fish anywhere with this. That hook is um, covered up in 
in that uh, top like dorsal fin there. So you, you're not gonna get hung up a lot. Just a great bait by Mega Bass. So I definitely recommend you guys picking one of these up. If you can find them, they're selling out everywhere. So I have a couple more of these on back order that I didn't get in this order. Went with the Kytex. I really like this color. This is the, uh, I think it's the Pro Blue. Yeah, Pro Blue Red Pearl. And I got, this is the 4.3 inch over here. And this is the 3.8. Looks like a shag color. And it's got like a little, kind of a little hint of a reddish pink in it. But definitely going to be using these. Um, as trailers or just fishing them by themselves. Uh, the rest of the stuff's really not that fun. If you made it this far, I appreciate it. Let's see. Forgot one of these. This is Blue Bug from a Rage Tail Strike King. Rage Chunk, that is. Got some more hooks for my um, jerk baits. This is the Gamagatu Finesse Aaron Martin uh, Tournament Grade Hooks, size 6. Got two more of these while they were on sale. The Greg Hackney uh, Straight King Hack Attack Jig and half ounce. Heavy cover. Black and blue. Alright. Then I got the, uh, the, the Trocar Weedless Wacky Hooks and one op. This is for my Senkos. It's got that little weed guard on it for wacky rigging them. Love these hooks. Excellent hook guys. I've used these a lot. Your hookup ratio will definitely go up. You will get hung up some, but you're also going to land a lot of fish. So I'm a big fan of these hooks. I'm going to try these Easy Keeper. I don't have a, my Shimano X Pride don't have a hook keeper on it. So I'm going to try this and see if I like them. Um, never tried it. This is the Fuji Easy Keeper. And then I just got some more of the owner um, safety caps for my treble hooks. And then last I got a shirt, but this is not for me. This is for my son. He's six. Check out his videos too. I've been putting him on the channel. He does mystery tackle box unboxings every month. So I went ahead and got him one of these. We'll see if it fits them, but that's it, guys. That's all I got for you today. Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got one thing in here. This is my um, Dirty Jigs Tackle, the Matt Allen Tactical Bass on Swim Bait Head. And I got these for my Alabama rig. This is 1 8 ounce, and this is a gizzard shad. That's where the contacts are going to be going. But, like I was saying, um, Thanks for watching. Go to my channel, guys. Check out some of my other videos. I really enjoy doing these unboxings, but I like catching fish the most. Ah, uh, you thought I forgot, didn't you? Before we go, I got this one last surprise box I wanted to share with you guys. I know I've been talking too much already. Let's get this video done. I'm real excited about these guys. Something like that. I got the uh, Mike Buka Bull Shads. I got three of them. I got them all in uh, gizzard shag color. This is the 8 inch and this is the slow sink. Look at that. Can't wait to get that out on the reservoir and start throwing that thing all around. Alright, what's next? Here's the 6 inch. And then this is the five inch. I try to get away with throwing this thing in ponds and stuff too because it's smaller. Um, ton of different ways to fish this. There's a lot of videos out there on it. I've never owned one, but I decided to go ahead and pull the trigger and try these out. I know they catch big fish. Something big's getting caught with this. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this five inch out for you so you can see it. I like, I've, I haven't had any, I never bought a jointed swim bait. You can see right there. Whew, smells like paint. Um, you got the tail there. I don't know what he makes that tail out of, but pretty realistic bait. 
Yeah, this is in Gizzard Shad. Got the eyes there. Eyes looks good. The top of the bait for you. Again, guys, thanks for watching. Smash that subscribe button down if you haven't already for me. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you like the video. Share it. I really appreciate that. Thanks for coming through. You have officially been outdoored.